to the water The wild sea, the captain of the Right. Okay, from my gurnard, I have taken two fillets, which I'm going to take the bones out in a minute, but I'm also taking the wings, which is the best part of the fish, uh, in my humble opinion. It's got a lot of fat content and it tastes really good. I've also taken the roe, which you can steam or fry lightly. So the wings have a lot of meat in them. And take this one here out. Same applies if you're doing brum, so that there's, that's the only waste that's going to be left. And you can actually also take the frame off this and use it to make a fish stock and the head if you so wish. I'll be using that later on for a stock myself. Pop it over here. So here's the wing. Let's take a little bit of, uh, a little bit of gill still on it. But that there will go nicely in the pan. They're a beautiful wing. So, and that's a nice clean fillet with no bones in it. Perfect for sushi. A sushi master would be then cutting this in fine layers with a sushi knife. That's what I'm getting out of one fish like this. And I'm using the head and the spine and tail and the frame to make my fish stocks. And I'm also going to throw this, which is left over from my bones, also in my fish stocks. So I'm basically using everything. Now, I've taken the skin off, and also that the skin has a lot of goodness in it. Depends on what you're cooking. But for the dish I'm going to be cooking today, I'm not going to be having a skin on it. 